What's going on guys, Messi for FCB here and welcome to episode 18 of my career mode with Everton and we are going to find out what Manchester United want with me because they sent me a mail in the last episode and they want me to become their manager. £35,000 a week, that is very, very tempting but I believe, uh, they, uh, look I'm going to start and I'm going to see what you guys want but I think I should stick with Everton because I want to you know, get them into Europe and win the Champions League or something like that. You know, I th I think it would be best if I do stay. But leave le and let me know in the comment section below what do you think should happen. Um, so then look at this. I get an international management offer from Ireland, my home country. So this is very, very, very tempting for me, guys. I'm not gonna lie. So um, I do stall that. I reject Colombia because I don't want to go to Colombia. I decide to reject Denmark as well because I just don't want to go there. Be, being honest you guys um, so our next game is going to be up against Manchester United the club that have just offered me the managerial role so they're willing to sack Alex Ferguson and put me in and Baines is telling me that he thinks he should play for Oviedo so I do listen to him because Baines is better but we do get into this game against Man United so like Man United are a good strong side but as I've said already I want to make Everton a great team I think winning the Premier League will allow me to buy better players you know, just having all alone. But I think I'll have more fun with Everton than just going to a big club like Manchester United. But we are playing them in Old Trafford. And to get straight into it, Moraes in the 28 minutes takes his shot. The keeper saves it, but Nikita Jelovic just gets the rebound. Just, just, just in the 38 minute. That was very, very close. But we do take the lead in the 38 minute with Nikita Jelovic. Uh, lovely control off Jelovic. Probably should have been a goal. Great save by David De Gea. But uh, the defence was terrible. Uh, and look at the Shane Long breaks through in the 40 tournament just before half time and the finish past the goalkeeper 44 minute we have the lead 2 0 lead lovely goal from Shane Long he's amazing guys and that's how the game does finish so I was really happy with that result um, proven to Man United yet again what I wrote it um, Newcastle draw with Chelsea and Man City beat Southampton 2 0 no real surprises there I suppose Newcastle draw with Chelsea would be a bit of a surprise but uh, it doesn't really matter has <laughs> been honest with you. Uh, to be honest, like Man City aren't really going to be much of a challenge. Or a Celtic are the real, or not Celtic, Chelsea. Uh, but we do get a senior physiotherapist telling us that uh, uh, what's his face? Uh, Lean Osman is coming back. Sorry, sorry for calling him his face. But Lean Osman is back from injury. Uh, doesn't really matter that much to me. And I do bring Leighton Baines into the squad because he deserves to be in the squad so we do go into our next game which is up against Aston Villa and we're in February and it's snowing so I don't really know how that makes sense but anyway uh, that's what that's FIFA for you guys but the is it, this game wasn't going to be too hard because Aston Villa I don't rate him very much in FIFA but I'll give you a quick look at the table we have 60 points on match day 25 and Stephen Pina was played in in the 18th minute and he was always going to score past Shea given there a brilliant 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 goal there for the main man Pina he's not really a main man but he is a good player but look at this in the 32nd minute they do get their revenge uh, we man I think it is how you pronounce that I don't know he does score a goal it's a bit of a sweaty goal I'm just gonna say it there look at that uh, keeper really should have done better Tim Howard he is getting a bit of gold but Pina plays in Nikita Jelovic in the 53rd minute and look at that for a beautiful finish around Shea given lovely goal Nikita Jelovic, this is why I kept him and didn't sell him on to Real Madrid or any other club that came looking for him. So there were no other matches, so we do win that game 2-0. Um, forgot to include that, sorry guys. But um, we do get to talk about Manchester United, so I decide I'm going to be a bit cheeky and I'm going to unnerve them. This is in the FA Cup, so that will be the next episode, guys. So the video is now coming to an end, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Uh, thanks for watching. Please do be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Peace.